Hey man, Todd with Empowered Men Coaching. Just uh, in alone walking around today. Lots of people around the beach. Actually, there was some sun out today, so people are having a good time. I wanted to talk to you today about not jumping to conclusions. And it's in the context of you know, how do you have a life that's peaceful, tranquilo? There's so much going on in the world, there's so much going on in the news, and just people just continually make assumptions, create stories, uh, have opinions about things that are happening or aren't happening or could happen, and everything's conjecture, right? So it reminds me that we can really stress ourselves out when there's some uncertainty and we add a story onto that uncertainty and we're not dealing with like facts, right? I mean, something, somebody may say something or an event may have happened or an event didn't happen and we want to create and attach meaning to it. What does that mean? Why did they do that? What did they, you know, what's this, what's that? Maybe they meant this. And, you know, can you feel the energy? Can you feel how that just like ramps up? And my position, you know, my experience has been, there's so much extra energy, chaos, stress that gets created because we're just not dealing with what is. We're trying to deal with something before we know what is. So my encouragement to you today is just deal with what is. You know, if you need to wait for a conversation or someone to get back with you, just wait. Don't imagine all the different scenarios and create all the conversations and, you know, I'm going to do this or what if they do that? And it's like, you know, just chill. Just wait until you have the information to deal with, and in that moment, in the present moment, deal with it. So, this is kind of a lifestyle thing. This is a this is a, a way to to de-escalate, to eliminate some stress. And it goes like this: one, just deal with the facts. Just deal with the information. Don't put story around things that you don't have the information for, that you don't have all the facts, all the, um, the pertinent information. And the other is, um, when you do have to deal with something, when it is, you know, you're having the conversation or the information is in front of you, create some space for yourself. You don't have to respond immediately. You don't have to react, right? Take the time that you need to respond and just handle it that way, create some space. And I think by just dealing with the facts, dealing with what is, and when you know what is, allowing yourself some space to formulate your thoughts, think about next steps, you're gonna come to a place that is better in making decisions. And that's really what we're after, right? We just want to make the best decisions we can in our lives for the things that are going on. So, that's my, that's my hope for you guys today. That's my hope of a process you can use and think about. So, uh, yeah, it's a great day here and um, I'm taking it as it comes, right? I'm not... Uh, future thinking about, oh, maybe it's this or maybe it's that. It's like, I'll wait until I have the information. When I have the information, I'll think about it, create some space for myself, and then I'll respond. I'll make a decision. And hopefully it's the best decision for me. All right, well, I'm Todd with Empowered Men Coaching. Glad you guys are here. Please leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this topic of not jumping to conclusions, about waiting till you have the facts, the data, before you create scenarios and how that does or does not affect your stress. And please subscribe and I'll be talking to you again soon.
Take care. Ciao.